evening. Thank you, Mr. Chairman, Vice Chairman, for giving me an opportunity to speak to you today. It's I am speaking as a parent. I want, the, want everyone to know that. I promise I will be very brief. I would like to highlight what the school board discussions have been focused on this year. But before I get started, this is really far back. So if there's, can we at least move it forward? Because just me walking here, I feel like I was in Siberia. I think someone said that before. So I just want to make sure that we have a discussion on this because this is really too far back. So here's the discussions that we've had this year and we're already in November. To adjourn or not to adjourn. Reordering of the agenda items. Seating arrangements. Correct use of Robert's rules of order. Choosing a recruitment firm. Firing a superintendent. Hiring a superintendent. Hiring executive communication personnel. Hiring a human resource director. Committee board member changes. Updating policies or not. Correcting the draft of our minutes or approved minutes. Who is on first and who is on second. Now here are the areas where the board may need to continue to focus on for the rest of the school year. Instructional highlights. Decreasing disciplinary rates. Student SOL scores. Increasing graduation rates. Resources to increase support to our students who are struggling emotionally. Increasing diversity teacher recruitment. Increasing teacher compensation. Engaging with the economically disadvantaged student population. Building community partnerships. All students continue access to quality teachers. Continue access to safe buildings. Student access to community care. In other words, wraparound care. Addressing increasing building capacity levels in our schools. Providing programs that help promote student achievements. Whether or not we are meeting these goals of the strategic plan. This is what we should be focusing on. Let's ensure that the kids are all focused and priority. Thank you.